Hmm. Sorry, I got lost in thought. You had a job. Help me fulfill my life's work. A tower stands in the forest swamp near Old Vizima. A princess up top, dragon below? Thanks, but I'll pass. Silence, please. Legend says a mage and alchemist built the tower. No princesses or dragons. So what's my job? The mage died ages ago, and the tower was forgotten. The power within it attracted and deformed nearby creatures. In short, it breeds monsters? Precisely. I want to examine that source, Witcher, and write a dissertation certain to immortalize my name. I'll have access to secrets that have been hidden away in that tower for years. Unfortunately, the tower is locked. I'll pay 1,000 orins to whoever helps me get inside. I'll see what I can do, though I'm sure this won't be easy. Were it easy, I'd not need you. Breaking into a powerful mage's lab is complicated. We must gather detailed information on the tower. Where do I find it? In the tales and legends recounted by elders and swamp folk. In old books, too. Recorded wisdom is infinitely more reliable. Any specific titles in mind? Ransant Alvaro's The Secret Gates, and an alchemy treatise, Ain Sof Hour. I know a certain dwarf had a copy of The Secret Gates. The second book, written by an anonymous gnome, was lost long ago, and could be hard to find. While you search for these, you can test my newest invention, a crystal that links places of power and my workshop. It will allow you to teleport, disintegrating your being into billions of pieces that travel beyond the time-space curve. And then it'll reassemble my being in your lab? Sure about this? There is some chance of error, but it's minuscule. Hmm. Sorry, I got lost in thought. I'm here about the notice. You have Al Ghul Maro for me? Not yet, but I'll get you some soon. Hurry! I need it for my solutions. Hmm. Sorry, I got lost in thought. About the tower. Yes? Where can I find information on the tower? Books are the most reliable storage of knowledge. Anything else? Listen to the swamp dwellers, too. Folk knowledge, myths, and legends are useful. Though oral histories can become distorted. All right, I'll do that. Hmm. Sorry, I got lost in thought. See ya. What do you want? I'm looking for a book on the Swamp Tower. All right, yeah. Hmm. A passage in Alvaro's The Secret Gates focuses on magic towers. This particular tower? Yeah, he describes its history, too. I'll take it. Sadly, I don't have it. I've been trying for years to acquire the volume from Golan Vivaldi, but he is a stubborn dwarf. You try. Perhaps he'll sell it to you. Know anything else? I just remembered another book about the tower. I'm listening. Ain Safar, an alchemy treatise by gnomes. Difficult to find, but a certain hermit in the swamp might know something. Thanks for the advice.
What brings you here? Do you have a copy of the Secret Gates? I do, but I'm unwilling to part with it. I insist. Just give me a price. So be it. Sorry, I got lost in thought. About the tower. Yes? I have new information on the tower. Tell me quickly. Before this tower, the mage erected two others, but both collapsed. This one served as his house and lab. I knew that. Anything more? The mage lived there until he disappeared, most likely dead. He constructed clay golems that served him, but hardly seemed a major achievement. That would agree with the legends of the Sentry. There are ten cornerstones involving the elements and threads of fate from which all this was born. Sephiroth! So the old scrolls are true! One book contained hints of the stone's whereabouts. We must find all ten Sephiroth. I own one of them, Chokma, the Stone of Wisdom. I suppose I'm to find the others? Yes. Near the tower, you'll find a circle of stone obelisks. When you have all ten Sephiroth, place them on the obelisks. Ah, so close. What a breakthrough. I'll abolish the theory of those stuffy professors in Oxenfort. I'll destroy them, smash them. Kalkstein, don't get worked up until I find the stones, which won't be easy. The information in these books is murky at best. Sorry, could you show me these books? I'll make notes for you. Here. There you are. Tip that! You're dead. Thanks, Gerald. You saved my life. The bastards snuck in here. Somehow they found out I'm after them. Who? What happened? Salamandra. I was a step away from solving the mystery. One small step. Relax, Raymond. You're safe now. Not likely. They're following me day and night. I gotta find a way to lose them. What do we do? I'll set a false trail. You question the new suspects. Who? Here, take these notes. They list all the key leads. What do you intend to do? They're on my heels, so I've got to disappear. I'll draw them away while you pursue the investigation. I'll find you, White Wolf.
Yes? This investigation is getting expensive. I'm not the Prophet Labiota. I can't live on roots and berries. Neither can my informers. I guarantee you these are the bare necessities. All right. 200 orans. Down to business. They transferred the prisoner after the attack. Not good. Especially since we won't get anything else out of him. He died last night. How did that happen? Well, he wasn't in great shape, so I guess it's no surprise. But I have a feeling... Someone helped him along? Exactly. Shani is a good friend of yours, right? Ask her to do an autopsy. Once we know the cause of death... Wait a minute. Are you spying on me? That's my job. See you later. Yes? I have the autopsy results. And? I'm certain it was Kalkstein. How do you know? The liver was cirrhotic. The stab wounds were just a clumsy attempt to hide the real reason. So, poison after all. But how can you be sure it was Kalkstein? Changes in the eyeballs. Typical of alchemical poisons. I see you did your homework. I sure did. Come back later. I need to analyze this information. 